Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on forming a grouped frequency table. So we've got this question here, the lengths of 10 rulers, I don't know why I would measure a ruler, but whatever, are measured as follows. We've got 4 centimetres, 31 centimetres, etc. And we want to complete the following grouped frequency table. Now, we use a grouped frequency table if there's lots of different values, because can you see there's no duplicates here, there's no length of a ruler that occurs more than once. Now, if we try to show that as a frequency table, it'd be a rubbish table because each of those lengths would each have a frequency of one. So what we tend to do is to group the value in different intervals, in different ranges. So if we look at this table here, we can see we've got one interval, this is called an interval, of 0 to 10. And this is an inequality and it just basically means that we're interested in all the rulers which are between 0 and 10 centimetres. So let's try and count those. Let's find the frequency. Remember frequency just means how common that value is. So how many lengths are there between 0 and 10? Well we can see that one is 1, 2 and that's it. And notice we're not going to include that 10 centimetres because can you see that our length here can be anything greater or equal to zero, but it has to be less than 10. Now, if we said less than 10, that doesn't include 10 itself. So we're not going to include this ruler of 10 centimetres long. Now, the next interval is 10 to 20, including the 10 centimetres, but not including the 20 because X is less than 20. So how many rulers are between 10 and 20, exclusive of 20? Well, we've got one, we've got two, and we've got three, so there's three rulers. What about 20 to 30? Well, we've got one, two, three, four. And how many rulers between 30 and 40 centimeters? Well, we've got one, and that's it. Now, just to check if your answer might be right, if you add these frequencies together, that should come to how many rulers you have in total. Now, if you add 2, 3, 4, and 1, that adds up to 10, and we have 10 rulers. So we probably got these frequencies right.